How much are you asking for the game? ¿Ese también nada? Ahorita se lo tiene. Ah, no lo tiene. No. That's right here. Oh, thank you. Thank you. the N64. Okay. Um, if you give me 20 on these and then to give me 25 on all that. Okay, sounds good. Hey YouTube, I'm here to show my video game pickups for the third week of August 2015. Uh, pretty slow week overall. Uh, Grass selling didn't go that great, but still picked up a few items. So I'll show you what I got. Same with thrifting. You notice there's a slightly different background behind me. Picked this up probably a month or two months ago. I got like um, for like a dollar. Um, some lady was selling a lot, a lot of posters, and she had this very, very long poster. I probably mentioned this before. This is actually only two out of six posters for this. It's the Super Mario Sunshine Nintendo GameCube poster. Uh, I thought I'd just put it in the background. I'll probably show you the rest next week or next time when I do a video. If anyone's actually interested in this poster set, it's six posters, uh, just let me know. If you want to pay for shipping, uh, you, know, you got to pay for shipping for this because uh, I bought it, but then I realized I probably will not use it, so it might be better for someone else who wants it. Uh, just let me know. Like I said, you have the cover for shipping, but I'm going to use a different background, the other background, next week. So maybe in September um, we can do something. So I'll go through what I got this week. Uh, not that many pickups. Uh, spy footage, very, very little. Just because 
usually around between 7 and 8 I pick up most of my stuff and 7 and through 8 a.m. was just awful for me. I didn't pick up anything, so uh, I wasn't expecting that much for yesterday. Still got one nice pickup, uh, Xbox 360 lot. So for the thrifting stuff, uh, only a few items here. Uh, for the game, <laughs> I'm thinking of the game, stop. At the Goodwill, uh, two items, Littles Pet Shop for $2, sealed. And uh, we play for two dollars. And then at Savers, a few games here, just a few PS1 games for three dollars a piece. Uh, Disney titles, Buzz Lightyear, Inspector Gadget, and uh, 102 Dalmatians. And then I think I picked up one GameCube game at Salvation Army for four forty-nine. Uh, Pitfall for the GameCube. Picked up also a few consoles at. Goodwill, one console actually, console only, one week for 16 bucks, and then two PS2s at Savers, this one was 20, and then another one was 25, but this one came with two controllers, the other one was just the power adapter. This one, you notice that the case is different, um, the back is different, um, I think they just replaced the case, uh, not sure why people would do that. But it still worked fine. Um, I mean, you can still check the model number when you log in. So I also picked up two handheld consoles. I saved those at the same time. Two DS's, really nice condition. DS lights, uh, one black and uh, one silver for I think sixteen dollars, originally twenty dollars, but I used the coupon. Uh, uh, inside the PS2s. Two games uh, inside the modern one, I guess I'll call it Gran Turismo 3, and then uh, for the non modern one, Saga Frontiers 2 for the PS1. So it's a pretty good pickup, sort of lucky pickup. Uh, so, like I said, Garage Sale Wise, not the greatest. Um, some postings that I went to, it was overpriced, or one of them looked really, really good, but eventually I think that person decided to sell it to her brother or give it to her brother. So. Uh, that's how it goes sometimes. Sometimes they go really well, sometimes really bad. Uh, for the spy footage, um, I can watch the I was actually there at 8.30 and it was a 9 o'clock posting. Uh, so, 25 bucks came with the N64. And then came with three controllers, but I'll show you just two of the Nintendo brand ones. And then uh, one rumble pack and came with Diddy Kong Racing. And then for $10 a piece, he said he had three. I don't know why I said I passed on the third one when he said he's going to go get it. Uh, I should have just bought all three of them. The Illuminator for the Game Boy. It is sealed, that's why I picked it up. Um, they do go for like 30 40 bucks on eBay, so not a terrible pickup. Uh, so some other side pickups. I think everything else was not spy footage, so um, I'll go through those. This was for two dollars, Loco Roco 2, and it also came in or we threw in Home Alone for the Game Boy. Oh, I missed a few other pickups at the same garage sale where I got the N64. Picked up three games for two dollars a piece House of the Dead 3, TMNT Turtles, just disc only, and uh, Grand Theft Auto 3. And actually, one other game for the Wii SmackDown vs. Raw 2011. So, the rest of the pickups were not on spy footage, uh, only two more pickups here, very light week. This one, I didn't know, the posting was 9 o'clock, and I didn't know that it was a block sale. It was a block sale that went way, way earlier, but I showed up exactly at 9 because it was just one house. Uh, so, a lot of places I asked, they said they just sold their stuff, or just a few of them. So, one place, I picked up 5 bucks, he said someone just came by and bought all the games, Connect. Five bucks. And then another place, I actually had a stack of PS4 games, but I wanted quite a bit of money, so I think the guy who probably came before me passed on these. I think I paid 45 for these games in total. Make Metal Gear Solid 5, Wolfenstein, The Order. This one just came out. Surprised you sell on it. Killzone, Shadow King, Fall, and finally Thief. Not the greatest of deals, but 
PS4 games, it's going to be hard to find in it. A great deal for PS4 games at a garage sale. And then, so one final pickup. This was around 9.30. It was a 9 o'clock garage sale. I think I had a really lucky year just because I walked up and then I see a stack of Xbox 360 games, but I don't see the console. And then suddenly the Xbox 360 console appears. Apparently the guy just brought this stuff out, even though it was a 9 o'clock garage sale. He must have had it in the back and so I just got really lucky here. So paid 120 for everything. I asked if you take 100, he said no. 110, he said no. So I'm like, you know what? 120, not a bad deal. Uh, a slim Xbox 360, 250 gig. Came with the power cords and everything. One controller. And then if you wanted 60 for the stack of games, he wouldn't separate them. So I was like, you know what? It's a pretty good deal. I think it was like 14 or 15 games in a total. So F1 2010. Dirt 3, a uh, sealed copy of Fable 3, World Series of Poker 2008, CSI, Fail Conspiracy, Red Dead Redemption, Halo Reach, a sealed copy of Connect Adventures, but not a very expensive game. Probably bundle that with the Connect Masters 2012, Sonic Unleashed, Tropico 3, Dance Central 2, Connect Sports Season 2, Civilization Revolution, Your Shape Fitness Evolve 2012, and then finally uh, Call of Duty Black Ops. Uh, so that is everything this week. Like I said, light, uh, light garage sale wise. I did actually have to go somewhere uh in the middle of the day around lunchtime so I actually ended my garage sale an hour earlier than I usually do. But still not a terrible week of stuff. Uh that Xbox 360 obviously was the best of this week. Um uh, can't complain. Sometimes you get a ton of stuff, sometimes you get nothing, sometimes it's just an average week. But overall pretty happy with what I got. Uh, I'm gonna check. I missed anything, I did not miss anything. Uh hopefully next week is better. Uh the following week Definitely will not do a pickups video because I'll actually be flying down to Dragon Con uh, for Dragon Con, but they also have some robotics thing there, so I'm going to do the robotics thing. Maybe I'll see some people from YouTube, maybe. Uh, we'll see what happens. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next week. See ya.